guys, my name is Patricia and welcome to a fun video where today we will be opening and reviewing some Wish products that will help me get started. Um, so basically just stuff that will help me video, take pictures, stuff like that. Just make it easier. So I figured why not film a couple videos of me setting up. So as you can see all this is blank. Um, I'm basically just on the floor so there will also be another video where I'm pretty much making this a YouTube space, like my own spot. Um, I did paint this. It was like a tan. But anyway. Um, usually Wish, Wish is like a cheap website where most things, um, come from overseas. They're like Chinese or like Asian. Um, they, there's a lot of knockoffs and just cheaper versions of things. Um, I've had a really good experience with Wish though. I actually love it. Um, I have the app and I order off of it all the time and I've always been happy with everything I've gotten. Um, I've never gotten anything the wrong color. Um, I do not order clothes from there. One time I ordered a shirt. And it came in just the worst fabric, looked nothing like the picture. Um, my husband did order a jacket, and he ordered it in a triple X, um, but it came in my size, so you know, that works out for me. Um, <laughs> anyways, we're going to get started with this one, uh, just because it's single and by itself. If you're wondering why there's holes in both of the packages, I cut off my address just because, you know, I don't want anyone to have it. Um, this one seems to be the car mount that I got. Usually it takes about a month for things from Wish to ship. I think I got these all before a month. Anyways, I'm going to put it together. Um, it seems like this piece, separate, and this looks like, okay, this goes on first. Then you click that on. The thing about this is you have to like figure it out in front of everyone. Okay, so three pieces, not bad. So this piece which attaches to your windshield or window or whatever, and this piece to make it all connect well, and then this piece will hold your phone or whatever. Uh, I'm gonna be using my iPod just to show you. So just clamps right on, so it should fit any device. I mean, it gets pretty big. I mean, it's not gonna fit a tablet or anything, but any phone, it should fit. Oh, it will not fit upward. So if you're trying to put your phone this way, it won't work. But this way, it should work. And since this moves, you can make it go like that if you want it to. Um, so I'm gonna test how it sticks and show you guys how that works. As you can see, it's not on my car windshield or anything. I just put it on my bedroom window just because I was right next to it. And as you can see, it went on pretty well and it's pretty sturdy and you can move it however you want it. And all I did was, I always lick it before I stick it on. So I licked it and there's like a little button that you push down for the extra suction and you're all set. Like I said, you can move it however you'd like to and it's pretty sturdy. So thumbs up for me. Um, seems like a good product, and I'm pretty sure I'll get a lot of use out of it. All right, so now we're going to be getting into the big package. I'm going to rip it open, and we're just going to take it as it goes. I think it feels like there's three in here. I was feeling it earlier. Uh, I'm hoping to get the tripod first, just so I don't have to prop my phone up against my lamp. But we'll see. So, yep, there's three. Um, this one. This one. And this one. Uh, we're going to go with this one first just because it kind of feels like it might be the tripod selfie stick that I ordered. Alright, so we're going to open this one up. And it is... Okay, it's like falling out of the box. So if you... And a piece just fell out. So if you're buying this for a gift, I mean, the box is a little smushed and the bottom was a little open. But the first thing that fell out is the little camera button. So like, this is a tripod plus a selfie stick. So if you're using the selfie stick and you obviously can't reach the button, you can click this. And I guess you can take pictures if it's like propped up somewhere on the tripod. So got that. I don't know how well it's going to sync up. Okay, and then there's one other piece, which is the selfie stick itself. I got my iPod and I got it um, mounted to it. And it seems like it should fit just about any phone because it stretches even further than my iPod. So if you have like a bigger phone, like I don't know, the Maxes or whatever, 
it should fit. So standard selfie stick stretches. Like I said, it came with a button, so you should be able to take a picture when it's super far away. Tilts, and you can lock it with a little lock and make it loose or tight. Uh, then this, pull that off. I guess it's like the lock. Then these will fall down to make the tripod. Um, yeah, and okay, so you just twist it and it should become stiff. And I'm going to start filming from this now because I'm really excited about this. But um, this works well, and this was pretty cheap. I will also say all the prices because I totally forgot to mention that. <laughs> okay, so I was just fiddling around with this little button. There's an on-off switch, and when you do cut it on, there's a little blue light that switches on. And then it says Android for this button and iOS for the top one. And when I click iOS, okay, so... I don't know. It seems like it's making my volume go up. I don't know if you guys saw that. Let me show you again. Do you see that? Okay. I don't know. So maybe I need to go to my camera and then flip it on me. Okay. Oh, okay. There we go. So you just have to, I guess, if you're listening to music, you could use this for your volume if it's by your speaker. I don't know. That's a helpful tool, maybe. Uh, but it did take a picture, so that, that worked. It sunk up well. And so now I'm going to tell you the prices of both of them because I totally forgot to include prices when I was just bragging about how cheap things from Wish are. So I'm going to look them up really quick and I'll be right back. So the first one, the car mount, was $2. And I think it had 2 or $3 of shipping on it. So I guess about 5 bucks, which I think is pretty reasonable. Sorry, I have my hands on the desk because it's shaking. And the selfie stick tripod with the cool little picture taking button was $2.85. And I think there's $3 shipping on it. So really, I mean, you get excited because you're like, whoa, $2.85. And then you get to your cart and you're like, where did all this extra like cost come from? And it's because of the shipping, which they kind of get you, but you're still getting such a good deal that it doesn't really matter. But anyways, I'm happy with it. Um, and when I pull it up on my account, it doesn't say how much I paid for shipping, so it's kind of difficult to tell you guys. Next time I'll try to remember to write down what my shipping was. Um, so we still have a couple more things, so I'm going to open up the last two. Okay, so next is this uh, medium white package. It's got some foam in there to protect it. Any guesses on what it is? Well, I know. So this is, this is kind of similar to the, it is a tripod, and it comes with another button. This one's in like a little baggie, so I'm going to open that, get it out. And then we have the tripod itself. So it's one of those ones where you can kind of go wherever you want, so, and it kind of twists around it. So like say you're in the woods and there's nothing to prop your tripod up on. You can just like literally just wrap this like around a limb, like just in case you just need to film or take a picture or something. So you can just maneuver however you want. So it'll just hang on to anything. Let's, let's make it hang on to my arm. Okay. Okay, see? So I don't know. So you can walk around like this and kind of film people. I'm gonna finish putting it together on my arm. Just. Just cause, why not? Huh. Okay, okay, so there's a little spot and you just screw it right there. I assume. That's about it. So it's pretty much together. They didn't even need this third arm, but we'll pretend like we're using it. Maybe we'll wrap it around here. Okay, um, once again, it like stretches, so it should fit just about anything. We're gonna use my iPod again. We're gonna sync up the other button thing too, just cause, why not? Kind of came off my hand while I was trying to put my phone in there, cause it's kind of hard to do with one hand. Okay. Okay. It's gonna be difficult. So we're gonna go to settings and then gonna go to Bluetooth. I'm just gonna take this off my arm. I can't do everything sideways like that. 
same deal turn it on blue button says don't pay attention to my nails uh ios or android this is an ios we're gonna click it okay so it also comes up as ab shutter 3 so both of them come up as the same thing then it comes up it says pair or cancel i clicked pair uh this thing was two dollars with three dollars shipping and now we're gonna go to my camera i'm gonna point it i guess kind of at me and it took a picture so it works like i said it can go anywhere probably more places than that one can it's i feel like it's a little bit more difficult just because it's so odd but i mean it works okay lastly this little guy um, I know what this is. This is going to be like the little mini ring light, halo light thing that you put around your camera to like take selfies and things and make just lighting better. Right now I'm just using sunlight and it seems like it's working pretty good, but you know, at night what are you going to do? All the packages rip open really easily, so it's nice. I brought scissors just in case and they were not needed. So. I would have probably went with the black one, but sometimes on Wish, depending on the color, certain colors will be cheaper. So this one was, I think the other ones were $2, but I got this one for $1 with $2 shipping. Is that right? I'm going to check. I don't expect it to come with batteries, so I will see what it needs and I will go get them. So I can show you guys that it works and just show you what it does. Okay, it takes two double A's. So I'm going to go look for some double A's. I think we just have, or sorry, triple A's. I think we just have double A's in our house, but I'll go check. And if not, I'll buy some, but, um, let me just show you how it works. It just clips right here. So you can just light up your face or light up whatever you're filming. And you could just switch it the other way if you wanted to put it around this camera too. And yeah, there we go. So $1, $2 shipping. Okay. I'll be back. All right guys, so I just uh, ran into Walmart and I got some triple A's and so we're gonna test it out. So light, medium, and high, and then cuts off. And then on my face, light, medium, and high. I really like it, I think it smooths you out. Um, it's making me look glossy probably because I'm a little sweaty. It's pretty hot outside. Um, but that's the last product that I ordered. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will try to post every Sunday. Please give me a thumbs up, comment, and subscribe if you'd like. And chime in with me next Sunday. Thank you so much. Bye.